What's up YouTube? Darren here from Darren On Demand. Today's video is going to be a walk around my studio and show you the items that I use to create my videos and my photography. Um, it's a small it's a small office stroke studio which I've created in our new apartment here in Benidorm. Um, so I'm going to take you around and show you the different bits and pieces that I use to create the videos and the photography that I do on a day to day basis. So right behind me is my setup. Let's go and have a look. So the current setup that I have is I have a iMac 21 inch and um, it's a 2012, a late 2012. Um, I've got all my software on here that I like to use. Um, the keyboard itself, which I'll jump to shortly, um, is a color keyboard. So the actual lights within the actual keyboard itself flash and light up at night time. So it's great when I'm uh, editing photos or working on the computer at night time, the actual keyboard is a light. Um, I also have a mic here for when I am doing my dubbing, when I'm actually recording doing voiceovers over the videos, if I'm doing a how-to video. Um, and then from there, I also have I'll just switch the camera around so that you can see from the other side. So as you can see from here, I actually have um, the Xeon Smooth 4 gimbal, which I use with my phone, which I'm currently recording on now. is Huawei. Um, I think it's a P20 Mate Lite, but I could be wrong. Um, the other thing I use is actually a, a ring light. This works brilliantly for when I'm doing close-up talks and it's just my head and we've got a low light situation. So with this, I can actually switch from two different color sources. I can do a warm light and then take the power down right down as you can see it's going down there and then I can bring it up I can then switch it over back to bright light which is like the daylight and again depending on the light that I need I can re reduce the um, the power right down on there as well so um, so yeah that's great and then when I don't want to use it anymore just press the off button and then Other thing that I actually use, if I'm doing some basic vlogs, um, is this Lumix camera. Um, it is actually Claire's, but I've um, taken charge of it for the time being because uh, she doesn't use it at all. So it's great because it has the like flip up screen, and um, I've been using that. The mic's not really great on it because there's no um, plug in for an external mic. So um, I have ordered and I am waiting for my uh, Canon M50, which is supposedly the best vlogging camera that there is on the market currently. So I don't actually know if that's true, but obviously when I get that, I will be doing a full review uh, on that as well for the channel. Um, I do also have, I do have there uh, a Canon 550D. Um, 
that was my go-to camera when I was a photographer back in the UK. Um, me and my wife actually had um, a studio, well, several different studios actually, over the period of time that we were in the UK. And I used that camera pretty much for all my photo shoots. When we actually moved to Spain, I sold the majority of my gear, but decided to keep the camera and the lenses. Um, the only thing that it's not really good on is um, video recording. Um, for some reason, I don't know if it's the SD cards that I use, but um, when I actually film, if there's too much noise or too much movement, the recording automatically stops. So um, I think I need a class 10 SD card, which I don't have for that camera. So, um, so yeah. But well, that's my little setup that I have here. Um, I'll put pictures up of the actual setup itself. Um, along with the iMac, I do actually have um, a MacBook Pro, which I use every day. I use that constantly for um, editing because I have a lot more software on my MacBook Pro than I do on my iMac. So what I will be doing eventually will be uh, putting the software onto my iMac as well so that I can actually use it from there. But currently I do a lot of my editing on my MacBook Pro because I can take it anywhere I want. If I go and sit in the bedroom, then I can actually have it on my lap and work from it. Whereas if I need to come into the office, sit down and actually go over things on my iMac, then I can do. Um, but other than that, that's my little office. I hope you like it. So if you do, please click that thumbs up button, click the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to the channel and click that little notification bell so that you can be informed of any new videos that I release like the one that you're watching now. But until the next time, guys, take care and I'll see you on the other side. Peace.